Hey, what's going on, city slickers and all my slickerettes? Um, I was in PA for a night. Um, I don't know if y'all heard me on the last vlog. I left the Bronx maybe like 2.30 in the morning, then I went to PA. And then I had to pay some bills today. So I said, um, let me come back, pay some bills, go for one more day, come back tomorrow. Just go relax. Got my boy D Nasty in the car. I told him to take a ride with me to the Bronx. And on the way to the Bronx, um, somewhere in Jersey, I started smelling something in the car. And um, I said, let me pull over at a, at a rest area. And when I pull over, to me, it smelled like the engine. So um, I said, you know what? I might need a little oil. And I always carry one quart of oil in the car for emergencies. So um, I put that quart, got off on the next exit, bought two more, oh wait. Jesus, I bought two quarts. I put one. Did I put both of those quarts in? Because now I'm thinking I bought like five quarts of oil. Let me double check this. All right, so I have three. Because um, I had one in the car. I put that in. I got off the next exit, went to the gas station and bought two. And out of the two that I bought, I added one. So I could keep one in the car. And when I got to the Bronx, I went to AutoZone and bought two more. So I have three. I don't know why this car doesn't burn oil. I don't know why it's burning oil. I'm wondering if I hit the oil pan, and when I hit the oil pan, the gasket on the oil pan might need to be replaced. Because if uh, if the gasket is messed up, like if you hit, like if you hit the, if you hit something, right? Under your car is your oil pan, most cars. The oil pan is at the bottom, so if you hit a bump or whatever, you can mess up the gasket, then it'll be leaking around the oil pan. It has to be because, but I drive a lot too. Let's say in one week, I could do 100 miles easy. Uh, like right now, I'm going to do 100 miles. I just did 200 miles, now I'm going to do it again. Um, going to Baltimore, same thing. It's 200 each way. Like 176 miles, something like that, yeah. And then to PA, it's probably like 120 miles each way. So I put a lot of miles on this car. And um, also the van, I gotta check this tire, the back tire, I think I gotta go get it sealed because I just had to add uh, air to the van. So yeah, so now I got three quarts of oil and um, yeah, something something's wrong because this car doesn't burn oil and it's burning a lot of oil. So it's full right now. What I'll do is I'll check it on my way back to New York. So uh, I think I'm going to head back, get something to eat, and hit the road. Looks like it's about to rain. Yeah. Hold on. Let me get in the car. All right, guys. I'm going to see you in a few. I'm uh, going to go my man, D-Nasty. You. Nena. Where's Nena? Condia, <laughs> she's in the back. All right, guys, I'm gonna hit the road. Uh, I was thinking about going to the city to give him the rest of that down payment for my merch. I owe him a few dollars for for my order, but I just do it uh, Friday when I pick him up. Yeah, I gotta pick it up Friday. Matter of fact, I'm gonna call him now. Yeah, I'm gonna call him now, ask him um, how that's going. And somebody need a XL, and another person needs a double XL. So I have to tell them to do that also. Um, I'm going to see you guys in a little while. Got a lot of driving to do. Let me see. I drove from the Bronx to Baltimore and I filled it up in Baltimore. Because what I do is I fill it up in New York. When I get to Baltimore, I fill it up to see how much I spent. And it's usually like 15 bucks. Now, going to PA. Uh, how much did it take? Seven when we got here? $7. So I filled it up in PA. I got to the Bronx. I filled it up again. It was $7. So it cost me $7 to go to the Poconos in this car. And it cost me $15 to go to Baltimore. I think that's amazing. You know, it's not a BMW or a Mercedes. But for a person like me, that uh, my bank account is funny right now, this is great. Like the van is too expensive. Um, the space is amazing, but you can't drive that every day. 
you'd be spending like, I don't know, two or three hundred a week in gas easy. Versus this, you spend maybe, he could drive all day, every day. I could drive all day. Right, let's say I could drive 12 hours in this car, and it'll probably be five bucks. Versus the van, 12 hours would be like 40 bucks. Five bucks here, 40 on the van. And that's expensive. Oh man, I gotta call one of my credit cards, man. <laughs> but everything else is paid, which is good. All right, let me get on the road. And uh, yeah, call this guy about the, uh, my order. See how that's going. I send him the logos. Was it this morning or yesterday? I sent him the logos yesterday, so I was hoping he got on it today. And hopefully by Thursday or Friday it should be ready. But I'll be back tomorrow. We'll go relax out there. And um, the reception is bad out there. So if y'all trying to call me, you gotta call me through Facebook. Facebook or text. You can text me or Facebook chat. That's the only way. Um, I'm going to get another phone. Yeah, well, I have two phones right now, but I need one for up there when I'm up there. All right, guys. I'll see you in a little while. I'm going to hit the road. i see you guys at PA. I got to come back. I got to see my son. Yeah. And I want to get him a raincoat. Something like this. All right, guys. Love you. See you in a little while. If you'd like to donate to the channel, um, NY City Slickers on Cash App. It's City Slicker with an S at the end on Cash App. If uh, you want to pre-order your merch, um, you can send it to my Cash App and also let me know what's going on. Or you can send the money order to my P.O. Box, which is P.O. Box 385, Bronx, New York, 10465. P.O. Box 385, Bronx, New York, 10465. If you want me to review anything, if you want to pre-order your merch, send it through um, with a um, money order, you send it to my P.O. Box. Or if you just want to do the cash app, no problem. And uh, yeah, see you guys in a little while. Let me eat something and I have to go. About to get this dye. That day, well, hair club for men. I got to dye this, man. It's getting too white. Oh, too much whiter. Yeah, nah, Santa. nah, nah. Looking like Santa Claus out here, man. Huh? All right, guys. See you in a little while. Peace. Shazam! Hey.